All right. Um, I want to thank Raleigh for doing that short interview. I don't know if part two is going to come out. Um, not sure if I'm going to do a part two. Um, but yeah, so I want to thank him on that. People can have their opinion, but you know, you cannot force someone, you know, your belief. Um, an opinion is not a fact. Difference. Okay. Again, here's a difference. People have an opinion, but when they try to convince people that their opinion is a fact and truth, it's not an opinion, is it? It's rumors, assumptions. Now, a certain person in that chat, I will not name, is lying, uh, no facts, and I guess they forgot what really happened. So, I want to, again, I'm not going to attack her, but here's the thing. Fact one, Shangi went out and did a video on me after Connor and Nathan and Bobby called Shangi. Shangi went after me because he's pissed off that these people contacted him and he didn't like it. Shangi first. He's the one first. He doxed my daughter, her face, her Facebook page, all her shit first. That happened way before my daughter. Way down the road. He doxed her way before she went on a panel and confronted her uncle. I'll tell you why. Because, again, people forget this shit. My brother, Greg, and Damien and April did shit. My brother was the first person to out-out private things but by lies. He's the one that put Jordan's shit out there. Oh, but people forget, right? Okay. So, get your facts straight, chick. Just saying. Not attacking you. Just saying. Facts straight first. So, when my brother went out there, discussed things on my daughter that was private. The only shit I did, I responded and I defended it. So, he's the one first that went out there and he put out the private shit about my daughter. But again, people forget this, right? So, Shangi doxed her first. Everything chick again not attacking you but everything was shown on my first two channels which those two chicks did take down my channels i kept showing proof i did show proof stop saying i showed no proof i have been showing proof and those channels were taken down this person knows her involvement when she was actually with Susie. This, again, not attacking you, but this chick knows what she did when she was around Susie. And because of that shit happened with Susie, I did let some things go. But she can't. Again, I'm not attacking her. I'm saying facts. He docks my daughter first. In a video, after... People came to him and gave him a new asshole. That's what was shown. Okay. When my brother again discussed my kids' private stuff and added lies, I only responded to my brother. I responded to Damien and to April. I responded and defended. All of these videos have been shown over and over again. How can you miss this? It's been shown. No, I did not dox my daughter. That was Shangi. Did not dox her private shit. That was Greg. I've been blamed for putting out someone's uh, information on a sex site. Not me. It was Shangi. Okay, right. But people just have brain damage and forget this. Just saying. But how can you miss this shit when they've been rehashing the videos over and over? They show them in order. He shows.
showed my daughter. He contacted my kid. But it's okay, right? Okay. Anyway, I only discuss certain things in response and defend my kid. Also, I've shown evidence. I did show evidence of what happened. Again, those two chicks took down my channels. Why? I showed information called the truth. I never used my kid's phone for dick pics off men on Facebook. What men? One man, I got a dick picture for proof, for the attention, the intention for that cop report. I just fucking said it on the fucking interview with Raleigh. What other men do I use for my daughter's phone? Really? You all just fucking play telephone and you say what you want to fucking say, right? What men? One man I did that with to get information for the fucking proof for what? The report. I never used her phone to get dick pictures from other men. It's a fucking lie. But people want to run with the crowd, right? Just saying. You want to sit there and chat. And lie about me with no facts and rehash it, rehash it, and rehash it. When you know what you've done. And I let go of all that shit that you done with Susie. Didn't I? I discussed what happened with you publicly and in private. That shit was dealt with, right? But no, you want to keep going and keep going and lie. I'm not trying to attack you, but you're in a chat room. And Raleigh's chat room lying about me. I don't know how people can miss this shit when these other golden girls, they freaking have been rehashing my videos with Shangy. It shows clearly, number one, again, he ducks my daughter first. I responded. Greg told information first with Damien first, with April first. Then I responded. I never put her shit out there first. Thank you very fucking much. People should get their facts straight before running their fucking mouth. I'm just saying. So, if I decide to let Raleigh interview me or go on a panel, great. The proof was shown. And channels. And more channels. And people took it fucking down. Well, why is that? Do you want me really? To show all this shit that you fucking did? No. Why? I'm not trying to attack you. I don't want to worth you, chick. But I could show all this shit you did. But guess what? I decided to let this shit go. But clearly, you can't. I'm not here to attack you, chick. But don't say shit that's not fucking true. My story has never changed. There is no other men for a dick pictures. The cops told me what to fucking do, and I did it for the fucking report. There are no other men on Facebook. Prove it. Prove it. Why the hell would I use her phone? I have my own phone. Like, seriously. Lure men in? Really? I'm going to say it right now. Certain people lied in court with me and Susie. Again, not attacking. I'm saying facts. I am so fucking tired of being on eggshells to make others happy. Stop fucking lying about me. You all know what you all did. Just saying. What's good for the goose is good for the gander. Peace out.